Happy Thanksgiving Eve from the fabulous Florida Keys. We have a lot to be thankful for here. It's just barely 8 a.m. and it's already 76 degrees outside. It's supposed to be in the mid-80s all day long. I'm planning on having Thanksgiving dinner outside in my yard. How about those of you up north? Where are you planning on eating? This is my morning market MLS update post I do every day right about this time. I report all the new listings that have come on the market in Key West and the lower keys in the last 24 hours. That's anything from Big Pine Key down to Key West. If you follow this post every day, you'll know about the listings the same day the realtors do. That's valuable information for a buyer to have and puts you ahead of most buyers. My experience in doing this for a little over 24 years has been most buyers will wait for a house to come on to Zillow. Then they'll frantically call their realtor wanting to see one. And unfortunately, anything that Zillow puts on the air live, on the internet live, I mean, They've been on the MLS a couple of days and all the good deals are gone and they call just to find out that they missed out, they missed the boat. If you follow this post, you won't miss that boat. You can also get a much more detailed description of these listings if you follow my blog, keywestinvesting.com. I'll put the web address in the description below, but it's keywestinvesting.com. Make sure you stay to the very end also, because that's where I'm going to tell you about a special I'm running where I'm willing to pay $1,000 of my closing costs to go right towards your commission. If you like this video, please let me know by clicking that thumbs up sign below. If you want to see more videos of this nature, the market updates are also just day-to-day -day living in Key West. So you'll film different tourist areas, or I might drive through a neighborhood I like a lot, or if there's a hot new listing, I'll do a walk around of it. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I try to put something out every day. I Once in a while, I miss a day. Things come up. We have to work. But I do my best to get something out every day. We have two new listings to talk about today in the market. But before I get into that, the state of Florida requires me to let you know the information I'm about to give you comes directly from the Florida Keys Multiple Listing Service. I'm not claiming any responsibility for these listings. I'm not claiming any of these listings to be my own listings, and I accept no responsibility for any inaccuracies that may be in the data I give you. I'm just simply reading it off the Florida Keys multiple listing service. As I said, we have two great homes to talk about. Both of them are actually pretty unique for Key West. The first one is brand new construction, which is pretty rare in Key West just because there's only so much island to go around. Most cases, the new construction is somebody bought a shack that was built and hasn't been maintained for 30 or 40 years and knock it to the ground. This one's a three-bedroom, six-bathroom, 2,165-square-foot house. Brand new construction. It's being offered at $2,595,000. It's on Johnson Street, which is in Key West Midtown neighborhood. It's pretty close to the beach, and you could easily take a bicycle to Duval Street. You could walk. It'd be a little bit of a walk, but it's doable. I know $2,595,000 may sound like a lot of money, but for brand new construction in Key West, it's actually a great deal. It's required to meet all the most current building standards. It's required to withstand 180-mile-an-hour wind load You know, in the event that we do have a hurricane. That will also result in your homeowner's insurance being much cheaper, too, because it meets all those requirements. And you'll also have a lot more appreciation because of the newer construction and the lower insurance. You know, a house with four or $5,000 insurance is certainly going to appreciate more than a house with $15,000 a year insurance. Next, we have a two-bedroom, one-bathroom condo, 750 square feet. That's on Flagler Ave. That's a great opportunity for a working professional in Key West to own a house on the actual island of Key West rather than going to Stock Island at an affordable price. It also make a great rental unit if you're looking for an investment unit. You could probably rent that out for twenty-five to twenty-seven hundred dollars a month, which would be about a six to seven percent ROI. That's certainly better than any savings account will give you. Also a great weekend crash pad for those of you that live in you know, West Palm, Fort Lauderdale, even Daytona, Miami, you know, Naples. You just want to come down to Key West for a long weekend. You got a place to stay. It's really good at affordable price. It's offered at $519,000, which is very low for being on the actual island of Key West. If you want to see any of these properties or any property anywhere in the Florida Keys, 
Give me a call at 305-731-0501. Now, as I promised about that $1,000 offer I'm making, if you buy or sell any house with me anywhere in the Florida Keys in calendar year 2023, I will contribute $1,000 of my commission to go right towards your closing costs. You don't have to close in 23 because I know we're getting relatively close to the end of the year. If you're selling, the listing agreement just needs to be signed in calendar year 2023. If you're buying, your signature just has to be on the contract for purchase and sale in calendar year 2023. Then we can close in 24 and I will still honor that $1,000. I will pay right out of my commission to go directly towards your closing costs. If you want to take a look at any properties in the Florida Keys, Give me a call, 305-731-0501. I'm Gary McAdams with eXp Realty.